My name is Markus Mertens and I work on the suspension for our solar vehicle. My name is Markus Eckstein and here at Sonnenwagen Aachen I'm leading the chassis team. My name is Bernd and I'm part of the mechanical team at Sonnenwagen Aachen. We at Sonnenwagen Aachen, we are building a solar car to compete in a race in Australia over 3,000 kilometers only with uh, solar energy. The main goal is to compete in the World Solar Challenge this year and we also try to catch the uh, interest of the general public for sustainable energy and for environmentally friendly projects. The race is very our concepts but our main idea is to innovate the idea of green mobility and of efficient driving strategies. We drive over 3,000 kilometers with an average speed of 80 kilometers per hour um, and we just use the power of the vacuum cleaner for that. Our association was founded around two years ago. We have a student team from students from the RWTH Aachen University and from the University of Applied Science in Aachen. We built this whole car from scratch, we don't have a prototype. So we found that for a creative design it's essential that you have a tool that is fast to use, easy to use and that also supports teamwork. First of all we created all our 3D stuff and later on we were able to do a lot of finite element analysis. Every part of our solar car is designed in fusion. You can uh, design your, your parts, you can uh, simulate your parts, and you can even render your parts. So we can use this program for many of our working steps. The most important feature for us was the cloud computing. No matter if you're at home or in the university or at our office, the cloud makes it easy to collaborate with one another. We didn't have tests with it before with the car, so we took road photos from the literature. And then in Fusion it's really easy to apply those to look which parts are critical, where do we have to improve. We can do this in many iterations uh, because everything is in one program. Due to the fact that Fusion is cloud-based and very intuitive to use, it is highly suitable for projects like ours.